If you look at cardiorespiratory fitness, it's even more profound. So um, if you look at people who are in the bottom 25% for their age and sex in terms of VO2 max, and you compare them to the people that are just at the 50th to 75th percentile, um, you're talking about a 2x difference roughly in the risk of ACM. If you compare the bottom 25% to the top 2.5%, so you're talking about, you know, bottom quarter to the elite for a given age, you're talking about 5x, wow. 400% difference in all cause mortality. That's probably the single strongest association I've seen for any modifiable behavior. Incredible. So uh, when you say elite, these are people that are running marathons at a pretty rapid clip? Not necessarily. It's just like what the VO2 max is for that. Like my VO2 max would be in the elite for my age group. Uh, my VO2 max, you know, but, but again, it's I'm, I'm training very deliberately to make sure that it's in that. So I wouldn't consider myself but I still maintain a VO2 max that is elite for my age. 